Hello, I'm Andrews, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4 as Communist Canada, People's Republic of Canada. We're going to be going to war with the United States fairly shortly. Uh, the reason I say fairly shortly is I don't want to let them get to the point where they can start fielding their army. How much will it cost me to go to war? Yeah, I can do that. Sure. So we'll be going to war before the end of the year. The idea being we can try and hit the United States before they can build up their military, which they will do, and they will do fast as soon as they can. Uh, in fact, so fast that it makes me actually want to start researching mobile warfare. I think that'll be the next thing we do next. In fact, yeah, no, not the next thing we do next. The next thing we do. In fact, we'll do it right now. I'm going to stop doing the Matilda, because that's going to take a while to roll out. Instead, I'm going to go straight and get motorized. It's going to take 180 days. I'm going to try and roll out um, some motorized divisions. The reason being, I want to micro them. I want to be able to micro them to like cut off units, um, cut through land. It's going to take us a long time to march over the United States. There's a lot of provinces. And we need to do that fast enough to get them to lose. And we don't have enough units to cover the ground, so I'm going to be going motorized units. In the meantime, why have I got day and night cycle on? Hmm. That should be off. Divisions. Um, no more infantry equipment. Sure. Reinforcements and upgrades I'm going to turn to minimum. Because I'm going to focus on getting new units out there. Very much a more Soviet thing to do. Ah, I don't care if they have guns or not. Just make sure they're out there on the battlefield. They can pick up the fallen guns of the enemy. Yeah, I, unfortunately, as much as I would love to uh, do that, I'm not really uh, thinking that's going to work for us. Instead, we're going to we're gonna actually leave this a little bit open. I'm going to place a unit there deliberately. What instead I'm going to do is put that front line there. Then I'm going to grab two units. One unit is going to be here. Actually, this is a two-unit wide area, isn't it? I should be using cavalry. Oh, wow. Okay, all cavalry. Fine. <sighs> Cover that end. Now, how much global power are we getting? Plus one. Sure. You know what? It might be time to consider flipping some people to communism. Ooh, you know what we could do? France, how str You're pretty strongly communist. Mm, it's not much, but it might be enough to send you over the top. If I can get you to be communist. You've got an election in 1940, so if you get an election... Either, that way we could just force you to a referendum. Uh, Mexico, also very tempting. But it depends if they get into the war. I don't think they'll join the United States. This is going to be an issue. We might just have just let them run into our country up here and then, like, put up a blockade here. This is only, what, like, four promises wide? One, two, three. Three promises wide at the narrowest, I think it is. Oh, I think we just did something. Uh, oh, that was probably infrastructure. Let's get construction effort. That'll get us civilian factories. I don't actually know we got time for that. We might to go infantry or something. We'll do it. Why not? Now, the United States has 70% national unity. Oh, they did the new deal. That means it's up by 10%. That's disappointing. I was hoping it was going to be a pushover. Tim Buck, angered by American posturing, those native citizens of People's Republic of Canada who imagine the American as people of peace are entirely out of touch with reality. Regardless, we must ready the people for war. Now here's the idea. We push him, we surround them, we kill them. We do it fast, we push on. Your initial order is going to be... Something like that. Followed by... That. Okay, what do we just research? Um, something industrial. Cool. I guess we'll go for improved machine tools, get that production cap up. I need to produce so many more things right now. At least the guns are being produced. Nowhere near fast enough. And I'll start producing them uh, here, in Northern Ontario. Hindenburg Incident. Ooh, it didn't actually explode. Awesome. Marco Polo Bridge Incident. Japanese and Chinese forces skirmished at a bridge just southwest of Beijing. 
It's Beijing, so just southwest. And the Japan's, Japan's here. China's here, just southwest of Beijing. We should be paused. Stop unpausing me. It's because I pause every time we see a vent and the game pauses automatically. I really wish I could turn that off. There might be a way. You could in U4. Um, actually, is... It's China. Oh, wrong one. Okay, right. So, yeah, Menkuko is a puppet of Japan. And Menkuko goes to here, which explains the southwest of Beijing thing. So, yeah, about here. Oh, it makes sense. Okay. So, no one's supporting Japan. In fact, China is having its imp in relations improved by um, the fascists. Okay. Construction effort three, construction two. We could get maintenance company. What about artillery? Oh, there's an artillery upgrade. Into artillery. Yes, I would like that. That would be very helpful. Uh, we probably need to improve our conscription. We're going to be extensive conscription. And national focus. I think we'll go army effort. So the initial aim is to push up here and separate these two groups, and then push down here. Timbuk calls to aid American workers. Is there a greater lie than the supposed liberty of the American people? Where the once slaved under the princes and the dukes who claimed ownership, we will crush their bourgeoisie dictatorship. Yeah, sounds good to me. Million air heart circumnavigates the globe. Quite an achievement. Oh, look at this, they've got all the units there. Yeah, they do not like us. They know war is coming. Um, you're almost done. What are you missing? Light tanks and equipment. Okay. And there's motorized. Right, let's start. Motorized, I'd like you to also have support artillery. Save you. And I will start training some motorized. And I'll be more monetary with you as well. Right, which unfortunately means we need to make motorized and artillery. Really? Don't my units have artillery already? I thought I added it. Okay, I need to add that then. Uh, that'll be the last thing to go. Um, but yeah, I would like motorized because that allow me to infiltrate gaps in enemy lines and stuff and expose them and work on that and etc. Blah, 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 blah. But yeah, we're also going to need um, to start spamming artillery. I very much think that getting artillery attached to units is going to help us. In fact, start exercising. It'll give me a little bit of experience as well. Motorization effort. Army. Wait, we got motorization effort? How oh, cool. Hmm, okay. Um, we'll go for. That gives us a land doctrine bonus. So we'll go equipment. We'll get a bonus on the next equipment. Yeah, let's get up to 10. Improved machining tools. We get concentrated industry. Improved factory output. And I guess I've just had something lying around, not actually researching for ages. I'm sure people were getting very annoyed about it. Uh, I'll get support weapons. It's ahead of time, but it'll be so beneficial. Nine. There we go, 10. I'm going to stop you exercising because I don't want you to use more of my uh, equipment. <laughs> that would be bad. I don't have much. Uh, and then we're going to grab uh, Division, Edit, Add Artillery. Yeah, I haven't actually edited anything on them yet. They need so much more, but that's all I have to do. Going for a very early war. We question American sovereignty, as we should. U.S. protection. The United States is now enforcing the Monroe Doctrine uh, much stricter. Besides the political influence they already have in our country, United States officials declare that we're now prepared to intervene in any conflict between American countries. And we have our justification. So, yeah, you want to intervene in this, America. Intervene in this, America. What do you need? 
three tanks and artillery. You know what? You're not going to get the artillery anytime soon, I'm afraid. So yeah, start spamming yourself. And I'm going to... I could put you on this... You know what? I'm going to split you in half. Select half. Go here. And get placed. Come on. You're going to act. You've been placed. There we go. Oh, this is going to be a lovely uh, defensive line. I'm sure it'll hold really well. That's just my hope. I'm just going to have to be able to hold that bit. And then, I guess, the offensive line is just going to be to grab that. Okay. Stalin, how much do you like me? Enough to get me in a faction? Not yet. Non-aggression pact. Still won't get me in your faction. I've got to improve relations. Come on, add me to your faction, mate. You know you want to... Should have done this beforehand, but I forgot. I need you to help me beat America. There's capitalist swines. You know you wanna. I mean, you're not really communist, are you? More like an oligarchy, but what else? Come on. I'll deal with that in a second. Come on. Oh, I need to go one over, don't I? Yes. There we go. Right, now, uh, next I think we go Doctrine. We'll grab... We've got a bonus on artillery. Ooh. A nice few days to get it ahead of time. That's not bad. Um, and also I want infantry equipment. Yeah. I'll grab that as well. Okay. War it is. You're on. Call in my allies. You're going to call in the Philippines, which is your puppet. Uh, I've got Air Force just sitting here. You can't reach the seaboard, so I'm going to put you over here. Nova Scotia. Push. Push. Oh, hello. We really have pushed. They've pushed as well. Soviet Union. Yeah, join, join, join. Let's slow that down a little bit. This is going to be very much about managing to uh, push for... Why are you not on the board already? Make sure we take every bit of land we can. Hopefully going to cut you off. That does remain to be seen. Why are you in the sea? You. I don't even know. Right, horsey, get to Detroit. Oh, you can't. It's literally actually through him. Okay, in which case, both of you can attack. What? No. You absolute moron. Don't do that. Get yourself over here. All right, you're moving in there. We are collapsing some of the line. Who is not fighting there? You are. Attack that one. Oh, you're there now. Yep, go for the eastern seaboard. Attack. I'm not sure you'll actually do anything, but sure, try it. Close enough. The organization is awful. We're close enough.
Yeah, there's a United States troop there, which I, I was expecting us to have as a troop station there, but we didn't. Should have done more micro there. Cut them off. We'll go down and grab Chicago with you. It's about plunging into their back lines now that they haven't got any fence there. Individual fights are not going great. Oh, you're trying to get to Montreal. Nope. Right. Start surrounding them. So this is going to be all about making sure we try and surround our victims. Why are you not traveling particularly fast? you just given up. Yeah, Eastern Canada, we're getting bombed relentlessly. There's nothing we can do about that. Come on, cut them off. Bloody hell, you take your time, don't you? There we go, you moved the province. Well done. It's a gold star. Right. You're engaged, you're trying to move. Are oh, you trying to move into this province? Okay, well, let's block this province if we can. How are we doing over here? Reasonably. Nah, not to get me. Not getting me. Still know how this battle's going. No one's told me. There's no, like, indicator. Ah, now you're going to start running out of uh, resources. Which I appreciate. Make sure you grab that, then they'll be supplied again. Got to open up supply lines. You, stay unsupplied. You, stay unsupplied. Night two. Looks like they've stopped their assault here. Do you want to declare war on Shaxi? This is completely historically correct, right? They don't have a port here, which means that this entire area, to come to declare war on China, this entire area might be getting attrition, which I approve of. I'm just going to keep them in. That's going to be the tricky part. Yeah, they're trying to get out. Stop bombing me! Shoot! I wish the Soviet Union would just send me some fighters or something. Something to help. I just keep pinning them in place. Yes, taking attrition. I approve. Go back and help kill that one. You guys keep pushing down to Chicago. Stop pushing. Told you. Hmm. 
That could be an issue. I'll have to watch that one carefully. How about over here? Oh, they're trying to push through, and I don't know if the units to really stop them right now. I'll expose myself a little bit here. Let's pull back. Oh, I don't want to pull back that. Oh, for God's sake. Go there. Thank you. How much attrition are you on? Hmm. Not great. Oh, they're going to block that. Okay, in which case I'm just going to sprint across here. I was going to go here and try and connect, but... Why is there a United States troop here? Hmm. Well, keep going. Doing a good job so far. Ah, oh, they're going to take the port. Don't really want to take that port. If they take that port, we're going to be in some trouble. Your attrition is going to be annoying. I don't really want to lose you. How are we doing with the rest of the production? It's probably slowed right down, I imagine. Yeah. Because most of our things are damaged, as expected. Well, I could deploy you, but you're going to be in a bit of a state. That said, warm bodies will help. You're up. Enjoy. It's all right. Now that people are in the field, I'm going to go for reinforcements and upgrades. Have we researched the second tier artillery yet? No, we're going to, weren't we? Oh, we are. No, we're going to. Okay. Now, this four. I'm going to send them all over here. But that'll be for next episode. If you have enjoyed so far, please remember to like. Not subscribe, please consider subscribing. Oh dear, they managed to push in here. I was hoping to box them in. We're going to have to think about that. Uh, but yeah, that'll be next episode. The war against the United States isn't going particularly well. They have more of Canada than we have of them. But we have managed to trap some of their army here. If we can kill that chunk of army, I'll be very pleased. Uh, but it's going to be a tough fight. I really am hoping that the Soviet Union sends someone over to help. They participate in our wars already? No. They, they say they participate in our war. They haven't actually participated in our war at all. It'd be very nice if they actually sent... Look at all this! Look at all this! You could you could spare me some... Look, you've got units here! You could spare me some of them! But no! Come on, Soviet Union. Get your ass in gear. I've been noticing. If you enjoyed, please like, not subscribe. Please consider subscribing. Of course, being a new series and stuff, do let me know down your thoughts. And, uh, of course, if you do want to like, then you really do like. It does help, uh, especially, you know, let me know what you want. Let me know what you kind of like on the channel and get that feedback like that. So, uh, yeah, do the do the interactions, the, the whatever it's called. There is a word for it. There's a word for interacting with the channel. And it's... I can't remember. This is like a technical term, but it's really obvious. And I'm stupid. But anyway, until next time, stay shiny.